Hello everyone, welcome back to Ed's Metal. Uh, we got a little bit different project today. I bought a little tool for my yard work to help me out with my yard work. I figured we'd do a box opening and see what I got. Um, we'll have to get it open and get things going and then I can give you a little bit of a review on it. But anyway, I'll show you what we got. We got a Craftsman pole saw, eight inch cut. Uh, 20 volt lithium battery. And it says it powers multiple tools. But this kit, uh, I think it'll extend to 14 feet with the extra pole in the middle has a eight inch bar and uh, like I said power to all you know power everything with these batteries any craftsman any craftsman tool 20 volt tool here's kind of the specs on it uh, pole chainsaw eight inch bar angled cutting head has a branch hook there uh, reach up to 14 feet soft grip handle it's a uh, I don't know if any of you have this VersaTrack thing hanging on your wall but evidently it's set up to hang on that already but uh, it's at it's at Lowe's Here's the item number. Currently, for the Memorial Day weekend, it's uh, $40 off. In our area, it's normally $169, and uh, it's $129 this weekend in their sale brochure. And I've been watching Harbor Freight and plenty of other sites, Walmart, their heart tools, and and uh, this is at $129 with the battery and charger is a real reasonable price. I think it's got Walmart beat on their saw, but and uh, I think at Harbor Freight you got to buy a saw, a battery charger, and a battery separately. Haven't paid a whole lot of attention, but this $129 package deal seemed to be pretty good. Like I said, Craftsman. Um, country of origin China as most craftsman tools are nowadays but uh, three-year warranty I have to read that but anyway there's a little bit of the specs on it but we'll get you set up here and we'll open this box and see what this thing looks like uh, be right back All right, here we go. I hope you get you guys set up at a pretty good angle here. Um, we'll give this thing an opening and see what we got here. So this came from Lowe's Memorial Day weekend sale. Well, that's pretty handy to get out of the box. No trouble with that. Packaged pretty well. Got uh, got the Craftsman charger here. Whoops, upside down. Sorry. Uh, this is for. Looks like it goes from lithium from uh, 12 volt to 20 volt Craftsman batteries. Got a lithium four amp hour, 20 volt battery. Four amp hour, that's pretty good. The higher the amp hour, the better, the longer these batteries last. So used to be 
if you had a half amp hour or one amp hour you were a big deal now four is probably one of the minimum ones but that a battery looks like it comes with a little accessory kit here instructions safety procedures i'm sure i know everybody reads them as seriously as i do craftsman and looks to be maybe a bottle of it's just an empty bottle i don't know it must be uh for bar chain oil or something to put in there but it's empty right now nothing in it and an allen allen wrench screwdriver combo probably assemble and disassemble the whole tool with this one one tool and here's the power head fairly lightweight which is nice that's a uh, that's what i want something fairly lightweight this must be for the VersaTrack system here or to hang it on your wall. Got your branch grabber there. And nice little eight inch bar. Chainsaw on the end of that. I don't see a spot for bar bar oil we'll have to read the read the instructions maybe just lubricate the chain itself but uh nice little plastic sheath to cover it which is always nice for storage so you don't bang the teeth of your saw but looks nice pole the pole seems to be some kind of fiberglass I'm sure it's got to be non-conductive material of some kind. And here's the bottom unit, your trigger, battery mount. Oh, that may may for hanging it on the wall. Um, looks like a safety safety down here of some kind. Got to cut that off there to even get it to fire. Craftsman. It's nice and lightweight. That's what I was after. Padded grip here. Said that on the box. But uh, there we go. And here's your extension extension pole sit on the box it'll reach 14 feet it looks like there's no cable or anything through this pole the power head it just power, provides electricity to the power head which is nice yeah let's see if we can get it together here without reading instructions that'd be pretty good Oh, it's, it's keyed so that it only goes together one way. Nice coarse thread. That... But there she be. With the extension in there and the power head. Let's get a tape measure out, see how long it is actually. Alright, from the battery. Battery to the 
Tip of the chainsaw, 119 inches, nine feet 11, basically. I suppose they, if you're five foot tall, that gives you your 14 foot reach. But that's the unit all, all put together here. I don't know about you guys, but I have a lot of trees and bushes to cut small branches out of all the time. Here's the, the, the items that came with it that we went over. Battery, charger, empty bottle, tool. <laughs> I don't know, that must be for the chain. And of course the instructions. Like I said, it's on sale this weekend, Memorial Day weekend at Lowe's for $129, $40 off the normal $169 price. But we'll get our char battery charged up and get back with you. We'll do a little demo and see how it works. See you in a bit. Well, hello. We're going to try out this new pole saw and see what it does on a few of these spindly little suckers on this elm tree over here. You got to keep them trimmed up or they get in the way of everything. I uh, hope you can see this. We'll get her going here.
Well, here we go. It seems to work pretty good. It does have a little bit of trouble sucking them small branches in into the chain guard there. But, uh, and I did have to tighten the clamps up. I may not have had them completely tight to begin with, but overall it's good for cutting them little branches out of there. Um, it's still, still a little heavy and awkward to use at full length, but it's better than the gas powered ones where they were really heavy. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, here we are after the first test run. Um, I'm happy with it. Seems like a fairly good product for the price range. Uh, the, the chain sheath, or it comes with that oil bottle holder built right on there. They tell you to oil the chain every time you have to charge the battery before use. So anyway, the only complaint I had is that it uh, likes to suck the little branches back up inside the chain guard here. Don't slow anything down. It just uh, kind of gets annoying. But this, this what they call a branch hook, that comes in handy to uh, grab the branch you cut and yank it out of the way. But overall, I give it, I give it a good grade. It's uh, pretty easy to operate. It's quiet. That's another thing compared to the gas ones that you don't got to run your ear ear plugs. But uh, I did have to tighten up the couplings one time during my use. But I don't know if I had them real tight to begin with. So, but overall, another decent Craftsman product for the price point. Um, I want to thank you all for watching and and uh, hit the like button and subscribe if you will and share it with somebody. Um, I kind of my title is Ed's Metal, but we do it all around here. Whatever comes down the down the pipe, we'll do it. Thanks for watching. Bye.